Okay, hey YouTube. So this video is gonna be about my current skateboard setup. I'm planning on going to New York City on Sunday, so I know there's gonna be many spots to skate there and here. I've been using this DGK 7.87 inch jack curtain deck for like one and a half months right now and I think it's pretty good. I never rode DGK before, but yeah, they're they're pretty good. This board, it feels it feels pretty new. It hasn't lost that much pop yet, but I'm not really that experienced, so I'm not one to judge. I haven't grinded on it much, but I think I'll definitely grind more in New York City. I live in a town right now where. There's like no rails to grind, and if I do grind, I'll get copped. And so, board 7.87 inch DGK. Trucks are just venture trucks, the standard venture ones. I'm using Bones Reds right now. They spin pretty good, and they're cheap, which is a good thing. And just some random wheels I've been using for like three years. So, so, these are all pretty much pro parts, and just buy quality. But buying quality means buying something that has a brand and is proven to be good. So don't buy the blank parts on eBay. You're you're trying to save money on them, but in the end, they just don't last as long, and you don't benefit as much from them. So just buy good parts. And, like, the type of deck, as long as it's a pro deck, I don't really care. I don't really mind who's on it, what brand. If it's a good brand that I like, like, as long as it's, it's standard 7-ply, not like the almost impact, double impact, Dark Star Armor Light, just not those high-tech decks, the standard decks, I don't think there's really much of a difference. Like, I know there's the concave, right? But, there... I've read online, and you could look this up, but they're made in like the same factory in China somewhere, so it didn't really matter much. But if you get a pro that you like, then that's an added bonus. Yeah, so that's my setup. Thanks for watching.